Math Planet is an app that can be used for elementary schoolers, up to middle schoolers, all the way up to adults that blends high needed skills with conceptual learning and fluency in math related topics. The app is made up of multiple games with levels that get harder as you go along. In this particular game, it is designed to work on proportions. So you would drag one half of the cake to each of the people in the directions below. Once you finish it, you click done to check your work. If you get it wrong, you can click reset and retry until you get it correct. As I said before, the each level within the game gets continuously harder the further you get along. It started out with a half, but now it's moved to a fourth. The way this one works is it started off as a whole cake and you had to use the arrows on the side right here where I'm drawing to cut the cake into the specific sections with the, from the directions at the bottom. They wanted a quarter of each cake so you know you needed to cut it into four pieces so then you could give each person one fourth of the cake. Then you click done to check your work. As the levels progressed you were no longer given specific directions at the bottom. Instead the people that you're giving the slices to ask for a specific amount. You can see Scuba here only wanted one third while Hojo over here wanted two thirds. So you needed to cut the cake over here into three pieces so, you would, so it would cut it right here. Then you could drag this section to Scuba and these two sections to Hojo. The final level of this game was unlike any of the other ones, whereas the previous levels in this game used food, this one wanted used liquids. So it told you to fill the glass halfway. You were shown that it was there was that was a fourth full, so you had to fill it halfway. So you dragged this thing up to halfway to get fill the jar halfway. Once you finish a specific level, you're taken back to the main screen where you can see all the levels you've already beaten. Once you've beaten the previous level, you unlock a new level. The app is really good at boosting self-esteem because it gives you more coins for each answer you get right. On this level, the directions ask you to pick whichever number was larger. In this case, you can see that 55 is larger than 50, so you would go ahead and click on 55. On this one, you can see that 80 is greater than 75. When you get it right, this green little check mark comes and shows you that you get it right and you're given more coins up in the corner. This boosts your self-esteem and shows you that you're, what you're doing is correct. However, in this one, there's a time limit, so you want to get through as many problems you can, as you can before the time runs out. Just like in the previous games, uh, the further you get along in the levels, they get harder. Instead of being whole numbers like they were in the previous questions, these questions have fractions. Now, they also give you a picture so you can visually see which one is greater. Since they both have the same denominator, you can see that whichever one has the greater numerator is larger. So in this case, 3 fourths is larger than 2 fourths. Once you completed all the levels within a specific planet, as you can see, you beat the planet and you unlocked a new planet. This app is really good for children who are good at math but they don't necessarily want to do it. It's a fun way for kids to participate and practice their math skills, but while doing it in a fun and easy manner that's competitive. Overall, this app was very fun while being very educational. I would recommend it to any teacher that teaches math. It's a fun way to get your students interested in math. You can have it as an after activity after they finish their assignments, or they can use it as a competition to play against other players in their class.